Deb Marburger, and I'm from the Fulton County Public Library here in Rochester. And I'm Kristen. I'm also a co-worker at the Fulton County Library. Um, today we're going to make coffee filter wreaths. Um, you can make these wreaths less than four dollars. What craft can't you do for less than that? Okay, the first step, get all of your supplies. This is a long insulator tube for pipes. It runs you about 80 cents for a six foot. What you're basically going to do is take it, fold it in half, stip it, that's a three foot, that's perfect size. Once you do that, sorry about that, you're gonna take and you're gonna tape it together with tape. Very simple, here you see that we've already done one. Just pull it together, tape it, tape the seams. Once you're done, you have a complete circle. The next thing you're gonna do is Take your coffee filters, undo one, and, and let me show you a, a quick trick. They're going to come like this. This, they pop right open. The main thing to do is get a whole pile of them loose. Save yourself some time, do the prep work. Once you have them loose, you're going to take and glue it, wrap around and glue it. Doesn't have to be neat, doesn't have to be pretty. But basically what you're doing is just covering the gray so you have a white, a white background if you see it through your coffee filters. That's all you have to do. So once that's done, you're all set. The next thing is we're gonna fold the coffee filters. And I'll be honest, I sit at home at night with a bag and I fold all the coffee filters at once because it's so time consuming. And here I'm gonna let Kristen show you how to fold them. There's no right or wrong folding a coffee filter. You fold it in half, fold it in half again, and then quarter it. And it doesn't matter if it's wrinkled, doesn't matter. Coffee filter is very forgiving. Again, you can fold it, you can quarter it, quarter again, doesn't have to be perfect. And then at the end, take and twist it. That is important because once you put it on the coffee filter, it's going to stand up a little bit better. It's not going to flop over on you. So here we've got one we're all ready to work on. Here's one that we have started. And you see it's starting to get really, really full. And Christian's here is going to show you how to glue. Just remember your glue gun is hot. And another thing, you're going to need lots and lots and lots of glue sticks. Buy a big pack of glue sticks. They're three or four bucks. You're going to need something to hold the coffee filter with. You don't want to burn your fingers. I mean, grab an old pen, pencil, something that doesn't have ink in it. You, it will heat. You don't want to use the ink. I use an old paintbrush. It's perfect. Put a little dab of glue on there. And she's going to take this. And the main thing is, usually I don't do it all at one time. The reason I don't do it like I did this one is it's harder to work with. It's easier to go all the way around the outside, lay your wreath flat, do it at the edge, do another layer on the inside, just keep filling it in until you're all the way on the inside, keep filling it up. And you can just hold it one, two, three, and you see it's laid down. That's fine. Once it stays there, sometimes they come apart. Perfect. Don't worry about it. Let's just say we do it like this. She's going to hold this down for you. And I just go one, two, three, four, five usually. If not, just smush it in there. Don't worry about the strings. You're going to have a mess. It's fine. You're going to do this all the way around. You're going to do another layer all the way around. And it's slowly going to look like this. You're going to notice that you got some empty spots. Just take a coffee. Take one of these. I'm going to let her show you. I'll put some glue on there for you soon. You can use your fingers, but it's easier using a paintbrush, something hard that will not melt. Like I said, if you use the end of a pen, please take out the ink and stuff first because it will burn and it will melt it from experience. 
Sometimes they just don't want to stick. Just squash it down. They're slowly going to fill in. The next step, how this is separated, take like you're scrunching your hair in the morning, like you're fluffing your hair. Just put your fingers in there. And let her. Yeah, you just get your fingers right in there. They pop open. They'll fill in. They fill in perfectly. And once you do that, you just fill the whole thing in. After you have it filled in, take ribbon. I always, it's just me. Take it off. On your ribbon, you're going to at least need 12 foot if you need ribbon. Get wired ribbon. Silky ribbon falls apart. It doesn't hold as well. You want wired ribbon, something that's sturdy. I'm going to have her hold this up here. Take a lot of glue. Glue it on there. I'm going to take and hold that. You're going to glue it. You're going to bring this through. You're going to do it twice. This, once we see this, I basically do it from the back like this. Take your scissors and just cut off somewhere in there. I want to cut her. Once you glue that to the back, we're going to turn it around. When your wreath is done, this is the fake part. This is just fake. It's on the blue one over here. You're going to notice this is just makes it look like it's holding it. This part is just for decoration. Then decide how long you want your hanger. Um, usually about 14 inches is, is pretty good. Cut another piece. Helps to have really good scissors. You can tell I've used my scissors for other things. You're going to put the glue on the inside. Make your loop. Make sure it's good and hot. Seal. Well, this glue gun doesn't want to cooperate today. But you're going to put a bunch of glue on the back. You're going to pretend this is, this is sealed. Just glue it right here, right like this. Very simple. Make sure, and if it doesn't, if it pulls away, put a little glue here, hold it. It's done. Once you turn it around, this is, this is fake. This is the fake part. If you turn it around, you're going to see this is my loop. I did the exact same thing there. You do not have to put a bow on it. I just made a bow separate at the back where you knot it together. Lots of glue. Just tons, tons, tons of glue. Put it right in the corner. Hold it. Make sure. Remember, the glue's hot. Hold it really, really tight. You have a perfect bow. I mean, perfect hanger. You're all set. And that's really all there is to making a coffee filter reef. How are you, sweetheart? You look pretty today. Yes. 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 How are you, buddy? Huh? <laughs> and you're the best of them all, aren't you? Oh my golly. Oh. Have you been a good girl? Can you tell me what you want for Christmas? Huh? What do you want? Have you been that good? Okay, we'll see what we can do, all right? You have a Merry Christmas now, okay? All righty. <gasps> Look at you. You got some penguins on today, don't you? Yeah, my huh? mom. Watch this. 
She did. Do you like penguins? Mm -hmm. You know, we got a lot of penguins up at the North Pole. They help the elves. Can you tell me what you want for Christmas? A penguin, huh? <laughs> all righty, we'll see what we can do about that, all right? You have a Merry Christmas now, okay? Oh, my, you're ready, ain't you? Oh, my golly. You got Miss Kitty on, on today? You like Miss Kitty? You've been a good girl? Can you tell me what you want for Christmas? Oh, my gosh, listen to her. Huh? Pardon me? Okay, we'll see what we can do about that then, okay? Here, you have a Merry Christmas now, all right? You can come right here. You want to come here and stand by Santa? You can come and stand by Santa. How are you, buddy? Huh? You're three? You know what you want for Christmas? What do you want? Okay, we'll see what we can do about that, all righty? And you have a Merry Christmas, okay? Thank you. You're welcome. You want to come here and stand by me? Come here, I got something for you. Come over here and stand right here. Shake my hand. You been a good boy? You haven't been a good boy? You're on the naughty list? You're going to have to be good then until Christmas, you know that? All right. Here, I got a little something for you. You have a Merry Christmas now. There we go. Yeah. You be a good boy now, okay? Oh, my. Look at you. You're all dressed up, aren't you? Oh, my golly. You're getting big. Have you been a good girl? Can you tell me what you want for Christmas? You don't know, just whatever I bring you? It'll be something nice, you know it. You can depend on Santa for something, huh? Here you go, we got a little something for you. You have a Merry Christmas now, okay? All righty. Oh my, you don't want to sit on my lap? Why not? You know, you're never too big to sit on Santa's lap. What do you want for Christmas? Tree. A tree? What kind of tree? A turtle tree. Okay, we'll see what we can do about that, all right? You have a Merry Christmas now, okay? All righty. You got your little pretty kitty cat on today? Is that what you want in your stocking, a kitty cat? Huh? Have you been a good girl? Can you tell Santa what you want for Christmas? Uh, Elsa and a... Uh, Anna and um... And the different clothes. Okay. We'll see what we can do about that, okay? You have a Merry Christmas now. How are you? Uh -huh. That's a pretty sweater you got on. Have you been a good girl? Can you tell me what you want for Christmas? Is that all? Okay, we'll see what we can do about that, all right? You have a Merry Christmas now, okay? And be a good girl. How you doing there? Good. You been out hunting? Got your camo on? You didn't shoot any of my reindeer, did you? Okay. I shoot it like some bears. You did? But no reindeer, okay. You want to tell me what you want for Christmas? I wish called that you can pull back and let go. And then it takes off? Okay, we'll see what we can do about that, all right? You be a good boy now. And have a Merry Christmas. You too. All righty. You're welcome. <sighs> How are you doing there? Good. Isn't that speedy? I have a car. You got a speedy car? 
Oh, man. That's a Hot Wheels, ain't it? Yeah. You want more Hot Wheels for Christmas? Yeah. Okay, we'll see what we can do about that, all right? Have you been good? You got to be good till Christmas time, too, you know it. Yeah. And you going to set some cookies and milk out for me? Okay. You have a Merry Christmas now, all right? Okay. <gasps> How are you doing? Oh my God, you've grown since last year. You gotten big, ain't you? You been good boy? Can you tell Santa what you want for Christmas? What you want? Huh? Whatever I bring you? Yes. Okay. Now you be a good boy. And you have a Merry Christmas now, okay? Oh, my, look at you. Oh. Have you been a good girl? Can you tell me what you want for Christmas? What do you want? Whatever I bring you? A doll, a horsey, something nice, some more, some more bling bling, huh? All righty. You have a Merry Christmas now, okay? All righty. Oh my, you're all dressed up today, aren't you? Have you been a good girl? Can you tell me what you want for Christmas? Christmas tree. Okay, we'll see what we can do about that, all right? Okay, looky over here. Looky, smile. Here, you have a Merry Christmas now, okay? You gonna sit on my lap? You don't need her, do you? Huh? You're not scared of Santa, are you? Have you been a good girl? Can you tell me what you want for Christmas? I want Elsa. Elsa? Okay, we'll see what we can do about that then, okay? You be a good girl. And you have a Merry Christmas. You gonna come see me? Are you gonna come see me? Well, you're all dressed up for me today, aren't you? Got your red candy cane outfit on. You're a pretty little thing. Have you been a good girl? Shake your head, yes. Have you been a good girl? Here, I got something for you. You have a Merry Christmas now, okay? Hi, Goldie, how are you? Doing pretty good. Have you been good? I have been. You know hey. what you want for Christmas? Yeah, I need um, some nice soft, hmm, <laughs> nice soft uh, fur for my nest so some, I can put my eggs in there. Some nesting material? Yeah, that would be awesome. And surely you need some nourishment, doesn't you? Oh, yes. I, I, you know what's the best at this time of year? What's that? It's some frozen worms. All right, mm, frozen worms. Just the spot. Hit the spot. Coming yep, from yep, the yep. North Pole, they're going to be frozen. Oh, yeah, they would be. Yeah. Whoa, I've been a really good girl, but don't tell Miss Nancy. Oh, I won't. Well, it's between you and me. All right. I've hey. heard things about that Nancy woman. <laughs> Yes, Santa. I yes. I want a I want a nice trip to Cancun. Okay. And and uh, will I go to Cancun? Um, could you maybe have some good things for us to eat and drink on the on the plane trip? Oh yes. Okay, good, good. And I've been good all year, no matter what he says. All year. I have been good all year. Okay. Okay. Okay, good. Thank you. All righty. You have a Merry Christmas now, okay? Thank you, you too. And be good, and I'll see you in Cancun. Okay, awesome! All right, yeah! yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, yeah. Knock, knock, knock. Who's there? Donut. Donut who? Do not open till Christmas the presents. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good, you oh, know? Oh, yeah. Hey, knock, knock. Knock, knock. Who's there? I 
hey, you're supposed to say who's oh, there, not me. Okay. Knock, knock. Who's there? Mary. Mary who? Merry Christmas. Yeah, that's <laughs> good too. <laughs> Very good. Yeah. You've been so, practicing, haven't you? Oh, I try to. I try to. Oh, you know what? I have a song for the boys and girls. You do? I do. We'll sing it. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. All right. 